Hey Raw Stars, it's me, Tiffany Ross. So today is a topic that I think that we're all gonna have our ears perked about. And it is, how do you deal with getting older? You know, most of us, when we're younger, we spend all this time trying to get older, and when we're older, we spend all this time trying to look younger. So where is the sweet spot? Where is that magic where we say, you know what, I'm just great right now. Now, in an ideal world, we could say, I'm like that every day, but all of us worry. And I'm gonna tell you, like in the fitness industry, <laughs> I am one of the old ones. Everyone out there in the YouTube or Instagram, whatever, is like 28. Everybody's 28. They're not moms as often as they are, you know, trying to slap a career and a job and keep their body in shape and stay competitive with all these little young, you know, active people. For me, you know, I'm of more of a mature state, which we won't even get into age because I think it's just a number, but it is really a state of mind that I want to talk about. And what makes us feel insecure is when we are competing. That's right. What makes us feel like we're never enough or that we're getting too old or we're not old enough is that we're constantly in the state of a competitive mind. We must change that. We must change our competitive minds to a creative mind. That's right, when you change from competition to creation, you actually grow in every moment. You actually are getting younger every day because your brain is firing new synapses. You're finding creative new ways to work out, creative new ways to dress your face, creative new ways to think about life. This is what aging is being creative about life and learning how to be spectacular in every moment, learning how to roll with the punches and realize that you don't have to stay down, that you can get back up. It takes maturity to learn these lessons. And this is the space that I want you guys to be in for not only for this challenge, but for the rest of your life. Whenever you feel that you're not enough, that you're overweight, that you're too old, that you're not smart enough, that you're a has-been in any business, I want you to say, Stop competing. There is no competition over there. It doesn't matter how young the next person is, how much older the next person is than you, if they have more wrinkles than you, if they have a bigger stomach than you. The only thing that matters is that you feel that you are great. Greatness cannot be denied. Greatness cannot be ignored. Greatness cannot be copied. You have to own it. It's exclusively yours. And that was the goal of this challenge. When you're done with this challenge, you need to feel like you're unstoppable because you are. You need to feel like there is no one that can touch you because they can't. There is only one you. And as you evolve into an older person, as you evolve into a more mature being, does it serve you to think about the past? what could have been, what it used to have been? Does it serve you to think about what this person is doing and that person is doing? Because when people look at you, they're not looking at other people, they're looking at you. Who are you? Show them who you are on a regular basis. And I always say, you know, age is nothing but a number. Fitness is what counts. So remember that, as you guys think about aging, as long as you can keep your body agile, you're jumping, you're being creative, you're constantly, flipping over those synapses, getting new cellular structures, and you're getting better. That's right, it is better with time. So that's my tip of the day, and I hope that you guys all take it to heart because it's real. This is about real life and reality. Do not compete. That's it, do not compete. Create, create yourself into the most spectacular being and own every moment of your life. That is my tip of the day, and remember, we're better together. Love you.